Wiggins goes left and puts it away. Brooks, good again! Oh my! Score. Murray sends the tone! I remember the first years in 1995 when we talked about Canadians, and you know, we'd have one or two Canadians in the NBA. A sprinkling of Canadian talent in the NCAA. We didn't have the rising stars, and because of the Raptors, because of Steve Nash, because of Vince Carter and that phenomenon that he became, they can believe that they can get there. It is just so fun to see how far it's come. For a lot of these kids, it's not a starting point, it's a launching pad. And there are scouts everywhere. I've talked to NBA scouts tonight, some NCAA scouts. So it's become a bit of a showcase showtime tonight. It's I know they like to call it an exhibition game, but they play hard. It's obviously gotten a lot better in terms of the compete level, a lot more interest from the NBA guys. 26 of the 30 teams uh, are here, and the guys want to be in it. The guys want to play hard, and they want to kind of prove their pecking order in basketball in Canada. We've exploded. I mean, somebody said it, and I like to say it's a hostile takeover. It's coming. We're really, you know, building it up. I think we got to continue to figure out how we do it in a way that keeps everybody moving forward. But uh, unbelievable job. Everybody in this country just really raising the game and the level of the game. Every year there's a couple dozen kids getting left out, so with the growing interest of basketball in Canada, it was time to have a second game to um, recognize a lot of players who have had fabulous senior seasons. He hasn't played in Canada in three years, because he obviously goes to school at Mount Bird in Florida, and you know, it meant a lot to come home and show the country what they're seeing only clips and highlights and stories about.